Hey everybody, welcome back to another Monday Plan With Me. I am planning for the week of the 19th to the 25th of March. I know you can't see anything yet. I will um, explain that in a minute. But I am using the Scribble Prints Co. Sweet Like Candy Kit, which I'm really excited about. I've been wanting to use this kit since it came out, I believe, last year. Um, but I think by the time this came out, that we had already gone to like the rodeo slash fair. So I didn't really have like the perfect time to use this kit. But this week is the perfect time. And I'm very excited because like I said, I've been wanting to use this kit for a long time. So this is the exclusive kit freebie. I have one of the a la carte items, which were the girls, which I love. They're so cute. Um, and then this is an older, like I said, this is like a year ago's kit. So it's a little bit of a different format. Um, so I don't have any of the larger flags up here. It's just the smaller hidden flags. So I'm not going to be using those, but that's fine. You have a lot of really large deco, which is why I whited out or white out. I don't know what the correct term for like white out, whited out is, but I did white out the, um, date covers because this deco is pretty big and I don't foresee me being able to use a lot of it without like a lot of it being cut off but I do still really like it so I'm going to try and incorporate it into the spread a little bit maybe just like with the little stars in places but we'll see um icons these are date dots and then time dots which I haven't seen in a hot minute um your functional sheet half boxes sheet headers in pattern washi little things solid washi and labels ombre heart checklist these full boxes which I freaking love they're my favorite very excited. And then your bottom washi, date cover strips, an extra full box, and then your glitter headers, which were also a la carte, but these are like a holographic kind of like fun rainbowy glitter headers. So I kind of, I'm like obsessed with these and I'm really excited to use these. So I also saw this washi and it's fairly plain. So I was thinking either A, I could do the washi just as it is and put deco on top of it, or B, I could try something that I've only ever tried once and put um, other washi down, like cut it in half and do other washi. So that's what I decided to do. I did, as you can see, white out the date covers. I also whited out like the first few lines um, at the bottom down here so I can do that. I didn't want to do white out on camera again because <laughs> the last time I did it for Avery's birthday week, it took me like a really long time to do that. Let me see if I can find Avery's birthday week. And it was just not a good, good time. Um, this was Avery's birthday week. So, let's do it. So, I decided to pull out my, uh, washi full samples of Simply Gilded, which I'm now, like, really, really, really obsessed with Simply Gilded, and I participated in the new release yesterday. I actually made sure, because I went to work yesterday, to clock out for my lunch at, like, roughly around the time that the releases would be, so I could be, like, panicked in that specific time frame and then I ended up getting everything I wanted which is pretty great and then I did sign up for the sub box uh, last week or the week before as well which was really exciting but anyway so this is the three samples I have um, I think I'm going to go ahead and use the purple because it just I mean the pink is great but it's kind of a lighter pink and the let's do it like this well, let me show you something else here. The purple kind of matches a little bit better. So it's like a purple with gold foil. I don't know, mixing metals, like I've said before, isn't like a thing, like a big thing to me. So I'm okay with that. So let's do this. So I am going to do the half washi, which I did not do last time. So this one is bothering me. So let's see if I can do this. Also, if you hear Brian talking in the background, I'm sorry. I've told him to be quiet like 30 times. He does not listen to me, but it's okay. Um, that's not going to work because it's already going down crooked for myself. <laughs> I'm already a mess. I'm going to try and line this up as like perfect as I can. And then I have small scissors. I probably should have grabbed my bigger ones. Also, this is like, <laughs> this is like a right-handed person's nightmare. It's okay. Oh, and you know what else I forgot to grab? A freaking ruler or some sort of like... Thing. I'll figure it out. I'll be fine. Okay, come off now. Thank you. Okay, so this week is kind of exciting, actually, not just because of the... Oh, God. And also, I just want to quickly say, too, that I am the absolute worst at cutting in straight lines. So, uh, and I watched Allie talk about this in her plan with me last week, and I was like, yeah, you're not the only freaking one. Because, like, this is just... It's just awful. I think it's just like literally just cutting it in half. So I think I'm just gonna kind of wing it for the second half. Anywho, but yeah, this week is gonna be pretty hectic, which I'm excited for, but also like, because last week was so nice. And I didn't really do anything like insane because I was out of school for the week. So I was able to just kind of like be myself. 
Um, this one is a little, like, not what I want, but let me see. Yeah, I need to fix that. Ugh. Some people make cutting and, like, the splice tool and everything look so easy, and that's fine. But I'm, like, not okay with this. Sorry you can't really see it at all. I just need to keep it up, like, close to my face because I do wear glasses, but I'm also still just, like, really blind. I think I need to go to the doctor, the eye doctor again. All right, so I'm going to line this one up right at the bottom, too, to cover those two. Um, I think that's perfectly fine. <laughs> okay, for a second I thought I put the wrong washi down, and I was, like, staring at it. Like, this cannot be right. Um, okay. Rip, please. Okay, cool. This is the weirdest sheet ever. I should just cut it completely, but whatever. I'm just living my best life. All right, and then I'm gonna do this side. I think this one probably was a little bit more even as far as my scissor cuts, but it's fine, I'll survive. Um, let's, here. I think I'm gonna need some sort of card. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to wing this. Do I have anything next to me? No. Whatever, I'll figure this out. So, make sure that's flat. Also, I feel like it would be easier if I had a roll, but whatever. Oh yeah, do I wanna leave a little bit of space? Not really, because if I don't leave space, then you won't, oh, I pulled up some white out. Um, if I don't leave space, then you won't be able to see the mess that is that cut line. Okay, so there's that. Let me get my splice tool, which again is uh, not my favorite thing on the planet, but if other people can do it, I should be able to, right? I don't know. Okay, stay completely down, please. Watching, like, Ali struggle with it, though, like, makes me feel better because I'm like, okay, maybe I'm not, like, the only person in the world, though. There. That's not bad. And then let's do this other side this down. I'm actually going to leave this like hanging off slightly because that cut wasn't super even and I don't want to like make it <laughs> like still keep it there. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I don't know if you know what I mean. I don't know if anybody knows what I mean. Okay, stay. Don't go too far. <laughs> okay. So this is double the cut. So let's see if I can do it. Also people like make it look really easy when they um, line, I'm like pulling up white out too, line up the, um, washi with like a, a paper, or like not a paper, excuse me, like a card and just rip it. People make that look really easy, which maybe it is with Simply Gilded. I haven't tried it with Simply Gilded yet, but I used to do it with, or used to try it with other various washies and it would not work. <laughs> I was like, okay. I hope this isn't making a lot of people mad at me. I'm sorry. But watching other people, like, struggle with this makes me feel better. But then I go and watch other people that are just phenomenal at using this, and I'm like, okay, thanks. There. That wasn't too awful. I was also kind of nervous with this washi sample. Well, I don't know why, actually, because I used the pink one last time, didn't I? Oh, no, I did use the purple one last time. Didn't I? Hold on. I don't... I thought I did, right? Hold on. I think I did use the purple one. No, I used the pink one. Okay, I don't know. For some reason, I was really nervous that with using the purple one, I had already used up most of it when I did, um, where'd I put the bag? I don't know. When I did Avery spread, but I obviously didn't. It's 24 inches samples, 24, 28 inch samples, so it's okay. That actually looks really pretty. Very good. Okay, so there's that. The semi-anxiety of that is over. Let's go ahead and do full boxes then. And we'll do date covers last. Which actually is cool because I can just go straight up and worry about covering the date covers later. I'm also gonna do those those things up here first. I'm gonna use the large, large, large um, flags because the small ones are way too small, but this is fine because I can cut them off. I'm gonna use that one and then yeah, I'll use this one because it's kind of like the opposite. It's gonna get covered for the most part anyway, so it's fine. Okay, so there's that. Let's keep this out. Um, the girl box, I'm going to be definitely putting along the side, so I don't wanna worry about that quite yet. And then, here's the other full boxes. Okay, do I wanna use the this one? I don't think I do. 
Oh, there's the thing. Okay, so that's fine. So Sweet Light Candy is going to go on the Thankful Thought Box. And then, of course, these two I am probably going to do in the middle again. Is that what I did last week? Because I really liked that. Oh, no, I did it up here. I think I liked that, actually, because then I left this completely open. So I'll do, like, dun, 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 no, dun, dun, dun. Duh, duh, duh. Right? Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Okay. Whew. Okay, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So I'm going to use the Ferris wheel on Wednesday. That was a lot easier, whitening it out before filming. I was talking to Allie about that too, and I was like, I'm pretty sure the reason I get like so crazy and willy-nilly with the whiteout while filming is because I kind of feel the pressure of filming and I'm like I need to do this and I need to make it like go fast so like I the whiting out part was not as painful as it has been in the past uh, due to that reason I'm gonna go every other since these colors are just different colors um, so this would be like one two 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 one okay but anyway so sorry about that and I apologize for the last plan with me where I was an absolute mess Avery's birthday which was like two months ago now, or not even two months ago, but you know what I mean. Okay, come on now. But yeah, this weekend I'm back in school. Um, I already looked at the two classes. They're pretty heavy, so it's going to be interesting, to say the least. Um, I'm, uh, I don't know. Just having this past, like, week off of school was really nice because... I did not, I actually didn't do a lot at all. I was going to say I did a lot, but I really didn't. Oh, I'm putting these way too high. I just realized that because I put this box a little lower than I normally do. Is it exactly where it like needs to be? Yeah, I think so. Anywho. So yeah, I did absolutely like nothing last week for the most part. So I literally just like lounged around so I feel like this week is going to be weird because I have to, like, get back into, like, a normal groove. Oh, for some reason that really threw me off because I keep thinking I need to be using, like, a different color. And I'm fine. Okay. But, yeah, this week's hectic. We're not only going to the fair, as you can tell. Well, the rodeo. But, um, we have, like, I'm back in school. We all have dentist appointments. There's just, like, a lot that's happening. A lot that I'm putting in on, like, a pre-planned day, I guess. Um, okay, so then I'm going to do this, no, <laughs> duh, this box here. So let's do the, mm, let's do the balloons. Oh, boy. Oh, no, wait, that is why I did that. Oh, I'm sure someone was yelling at me. Okay, hold on. There is a reason I did that, because I like being able to cover these. I'm so sorry, guys. My brain is not working today. Oh, but then that glitter header is going to look stupid. Oh, okay, hold on. Hold the phone. There is a reason I did it like that. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know if I'm going to be able to move up this full box at all, though. I'm not going to attempt the full box. This one is just going to be slightly lower than the rest, which will be fine. I'll deal with it later, but uh, sorry, guys. I forgot. Mm. Okay. I hate having to pull up anything, especially with this new paper, because, like, I think I pulled up one glitter header last week a couple too many times because, like, during the week I just kept seeing it, like, flapping in the wind. And I was like, okay, like, calm down. This one is not. Okay, hold on. I've seen people do this, too. Let's see if I can. Ooh, that worked. Okay. Now I'm, like, sweating. Why? Okay, there we go. But the good thing with these, like, glitter headers is, I'm going to actually use a different, is exactly that. I can use a different one because I have so many. So there is that. And I need, do need to move this one up then. Okay, this is, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm city is what this is. Mm-mm. I have an idea, but let's see if I can actually execute it. I'm going to take this 
washi. This piece is really small, but it's the exact same color and pattern as this background. And just kind of pull a little that. Not awful, right? Are you guys even in focus? Can you see? Is that okay? I don't know. Okay, so it, it worked. I mean, it's not awful, but oh my god. It's pretty bad. Okay, so balloons up here. I'm sorry, guys. I thought I had this. And then this girl up here. Nope, this girl will go here. No, because there's too many girls on that side. I'll put her on Tuesday, but just give me a second. I'm going to put this one on Monday. Okay, better. Much better. Oh, yeah. Okay. So let's just pay attention now, and you'll be fine. I was telling Allie, too, I was like, when I follow kits, I feel, like, so much better be about my spreads because it's not a lot of, like, thought, which is, I guess, nice. You don't have to, like, think too much about where you're putting things. But when I do, like, a rogue and I do things like this, I then get very confused. But it actually does end up all evening out because up here with the date covers, I can just kind of feel it out and, you know, make my own room if I have to. Like, this, for example, is too low. It's fine. Do I have... I actually have washi that'll fit this one, too. Hold on, guys. I can do this. I'm going to line this one up before I put down the glitter header. Okay. This isn't awful. I don't know if I had to do it, but there was a little bit of space that would have been really annoying, so. Hold on, blue, okay, blue. So I'll line this one up. I don't know why I had to line that one up. I think something just went rogue there. Whatever. Okay, so we're down to our last ones for these two rows. So I'm going to put those there. And then this one I was going to do on Tuesday. And then the double box on Saturday and Sunday. This is so cute. And this is so colorful. Which is fun because I can bring in a lot of different colors. Which is really exciting. The lighting, the brightness is turned up so high on this camera. Well, not super high because when I end up exporting it to my computer, it looks fine. But it's turned up so bright for me as far as the viewfinder goes that when I'm looking in it, I cannot tell for the life of me if you guys are focused or not. I'm just kind of hoping you are at this point. Um, okay, so let's save that box and do these glitter headers up here. Ah, oh, so much better. See, this turned out so nice. Okay. This coil is a little too heavy still for me. Is my phone going off? Oh no, I was like, what the heck is happening? Okay. But anyway, I hope you guys had a good week. My week was very up and down for me. Like, the first half of the week, I was really, like, not in a great mood. And, yeah. And then the second half, I felt a little bit better. I was having... A much better second half of the week I don't know how to explain it but yeah we did a lot of stuff with Avery this week it was nice I got to relax a lot because I mean I didn't have any school um, so there's that I'm gonna do the date covers then because I cannot stand staring at that for any longer um, okay, so I'm using, of course, Rose Color Days date covers, but they are not foil, okay? Are you guys ready for this? Her little freebie. This was the PVC Sale Friday exclusive freebie, which is, like, a really, like, perfect pink for this kit. I really like the way this, like, font is, so I'm gonna be using these. I almost used the blue foiled freebies, but I had a little bit of, like, a crisis with them, so I FaceTimed Allie and she helped me through it. So we decided to go with the pink because I will be, spoiler alert, writing in blue. And I feel like there's already kind of a lot of blue in this spread. So I kind of wanted to bring out some more of this pink. And I think this is going to turn out really well. And then when I do these date covers, um, especially just because, like, the way the font is, it's really difficult to put, like, a date cover down. Although I totally could put one above it. I usually don't, so I'm not going to. I usually, or I usually, I will know the date throughout the week, so it's okay. But... It's cute, and I don't think I've ever used up an entire free. Well, I've definitely used up an entire freebie before, but the, like all in one go, this is nice. So that sheet is finished. 
and there are our date covers so that looks really cute i really like it um okay so we are back in school this week um my two classes start on wednesday i'm taking health oh my gosh i'm taking healthcare policy and economics and operational analysis and quality improvement they're very long so i don't write them all down i just write their like class names down like the shortened names so i'm gonna go ahead and put like the homework stuff in first which i do have a class every thursday from now on so i have the crest press class labels um actually hold on a second i have a lot of stuff over here but i think i have something that would be cool i don't know if it would match though no it won't match um, so I'm going to use the class labels. I'm going to use, like, the light purple. This is, like, the winter colorway. I'm going to use this light purple and put this in on Thursday really quick before I forget. Because I feel like that is going to be something I'll do. Because with Monday, it was easy to um, remember. But Thursday is, like, midweek. So who knows. Okay, so there's that. Make sure everything's like, stuck down. And then let's go ahead and do my first stuff will be due... Thursday. Sorry, that washi is not staying down. So let me get my heart checklists and we'll start there. So I'll start with purple, some scissors. So Wednesday I have one, two, three, four, I need five hearts. Always planning like without school is fun for me, but I have to find things to fill up my days with. So having, sometimes having school stuff in is nice, but I do get kind of sad because I like having a lot of stuff to put in throughout the day. It's kind of like a double-edged sword, but I'll survive. Oh, Wednesday's busy. Oh no, it's not. It's fine. And then Thursday I have class and I have one, two, three, another five. It's kind of like an intro week, but I think I do have a couple of assignments to do as well, which is always kind of annoying, but I will survive. So let's put this pink one down under the class label. It takes up this entire box. Is there a lot going on Thursday? Kind of. I'll be fine. And then Friday, I need four. Yes. Two, three, four. Perfect. Ooh, and I got to use all the colors. I didn't have to use that, like, not have to, but I didn't use the cream color, so that's fun. So that is Friday. I'm kind of debating, honestly, after last week, which I feel like was one of my favorite weeks I've ever done. It turned out really, really, really well. Um, I'm kind of debating moving my school stuff out of my planner, but I also like having it right here because it's so accessible for me. Accessible? Accessible? I don't know. So I just, I need it. Anyway, let's zoom you guys in. We're going to do day by day. Um, I'm not working Monday this week. I'm working Tuesday through Saturday, so I don't need to worry about a Monday work label, but I do need to worry about three TV shows are, that are on on Monday. I have Teen Mom OG, The Alienist, and Unreal, so I am going to just grab three TV little things and stack them up. I'm going to try and line this up exactly with the washi, but... I really like this look. I think it's really nice. If I could perfect it, that would probably be ideal. But I just, you know, I mean, practice makes perfect. So I gotta, just gotta keep working with it. So there's that. Just enjoy my journey, I guess. <laughs> um, so there's the three TV shows. So all three of us have dentist appointments this day. I made sure to get us all three in on the same day because it would just be easier. And then Actually, a lot is happening. Um, we have to pay daycare, so let me get my, let me do that first. I have the Planner Gems crayons, which I love to use for paying daycare. Should I do purple? I need to get a new sheet out, but I'm gonna do this light purple and put it down here, like as far down as I possibly can go. Um, all three of us need to get dentist appointments, or we have dentist appointments. I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. We're getting groceries tomorrow, and I think that's kind of, it as of right now sorry these are all starting to peel up um so i want to do the dentist appointment the way i did avery's doctor's appointment i thought oh y'all i am so sorry i this camera doesn't notify me when it shuts off so i have literally no clue 
<sighs> when it does. And I apologize. I just went back and rewatched though to make sure I knew where it shut off. Because at first it said it only recorded for 16 minutes. And I was like, uh, no. Um, but the only thing it cut me off at was after this. So I did put down one of these Chic Street Sticker Boutique little like holographic post-its. I decided to go with this yellow kind of cream one. It matches the color really well. And I've decided, you know, when am I ever going to use like a lot of yellow in my spreads? So this is perfect. And then I did put a little, um, this is a custom Avery like in a doctor suit a doctor suit um you know what I'm talking about um from SPC and I have it right there I like it a lot better last time I did this with this I did a little stethoscope in this spread right here and I didn't like it so I ended up pulling it up and putting that down instead so I'm just gonna do like a little list of what times our doctors or dentists I keep wanting to say doctors dentist appointments are I think that will work out a little bit better but anyway, I am sorry about that, you guys. I need to figure something out with this camera. Anyway, so there's that. And then we are getting groceries and I'm getting my nails done. I don't think we're doing anything else super crazy that week. So I do have a little bit of space, which is nice. But, I mean, it kind of sucks. Um, so for my nails, I am going to be using one of the old $2 Tuesdays from, excuse me, from SPC. These were, like, the first kind of, like, multi-summer multicolor colors, which I kind of like because they're really bright and fun. Um, I haven't decided what color I'm getting on my nails. Well, I have decided, um, and I'm really excited about it, but, um, I don't know if I want to use that color because I've already used a lot of that color in this spread so far. So I think I'm going to use some pink, which I am going to get pink, I think, not next time, not like this day, but the next time. Uh, so let's use this kind of like bright pink here and I will put that right there and then we'll probably do groceries like immediately after dentist I don't know like the way this day is getting set up is weird so I'm gonna use an icon for that um, which would be on the front page which is where right here um, so I'm gonna use the little grocery cart I like using that I think this does give me if I put like a little bit of if I use the small icon that would give me some space so let's use the small icon which is pink put that in and then that gives me like a tiny bit of space if we do anything else to put right here so that is monday like if we go out to eat or something i don't know um tuesday i'm back at work so let's do just kind of in the order that i'm going i am using just like the regular multicolor like the first multicolor she came out with from caress press Okay, so on to Tuesday. Sorry I've done a lot of, like, cutting. I don't normally do that. Just, like, I keep hearing Brian, like, getting louder and progressively louder and louder. And I'm like, babe, you've got to be quiet or at least, like, semi-quiet. Okay, so I'm working Monday. Like I said, I'm using the regular multicolor from Crest Press. I have a lot of these that are already mostly used, but it should work. I'm going to be using this purple, though. I really like the light purple. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Okay, so let's do this on Tuesday. Cover up that bottom there. It's not like an exact match as you can see, but I'm not like super upset with it. Actually, I feel like that class label was more of an exact match, but I was just using this because like it was easier. Um, and then unit one starts the next day, so I want to be prepared for that. So I'm going to use the, let's do the, what color is the girl, the munchkin? Blue. Okay, so let's use the, no, I don't want to use blue. Let's use the cream with it, because I don't feel like I'm going to be using a lot of this cream. I say that as I already have that there, but whatever. And then I'm going to use the munchkin on the laptop right next to it. Right? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. I pulled something else out for it, but it ended up working out good. Because I was going to use the blue huge icon, and I didn't want, like, two blues right next to each other, but it does work out, so it's fine. Um, and then Avery has soccer again, which I'm really excited about because she didn't have soccer last week because it was, like, spring break. So I have the Once More With Love little soccer munchkins, which they are blue. Poop. Okay, that's fine. Let's just use it. So I'm going to use this right here for Avery soccer. And then it is the first day of spring, so I wanted to use something to kind of signify that since it would be covered. So as you can see, I'm pulling out some Coffee Monsters Co. emojis. These are the spring emojis. I have never used this sheet, and I'm so excited, and I don't know which one I want to use. Oh my god, I don't know. I really like this one, kind of like sipping a drink. That's really cute, but I also like the one with the flowers because I think that's adorable. So let's use a really teeny tiny one with the flowers. And I might move Avery's, like, soccer thing up a teeny, teeny bit. Like, and have it kind of touching. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I thought for a second these were all munchkins. I was going to say, this is a lot of munchkins. I'm going to have it touching up here. I kind of wrote heavy last week, and I can, can kind of feel it right here. Anyway, so there is Tuesday so far. 
Um, Wednesday, I am working again. What color is next? Pink? Let's do the pink. Oh, perfect. Is it this pink? Nice. Okay, so I have a really bright pink, which is fun. Put that right here. See, like, it looks bad when I first started doing all those headers and stuff, but as it gets filled out, it's okay. And then on Wednesday, I also have a ton of TV shows. Um, I have Riverdale, X-Files, Modern Family, and Criminal Minds all on Wednesdays. Like, Wednesdays are good TV show days. So I'm going to grab all four colors, which leaves me with one TV little thing left. But that's okay because we got asterisks, and I will survive. I keep saying that. I think that's, like, my motto for this, this plan with me. I was going to say this episode. Guys! I'm losing my mind. I actually did just wake up from a nap. Um, I was waiting for Avery to nap because I film these when she's napping. Otherwise, it would just be really loud. And I mean, I like it, but also, like, I don't know how well you would like it. And so I was waiting for her to nap, and I was in here reading, and I fell asleep too. So it was fun. Anyway, there's my stack of little things. I love the way that looks. I have nothing else going on Wednesday. If I do, I have a little space here, which is perfect. And I need to fix that header because you can see the kind of crookedness, but I'll do that later. Anyway, on to the second half of the week. Um, Thursday, of course, I'm working. The next color is blue. Uh, what blue did I want to do? Did I like that one? Yeah. Nice. They're all, like, readily available for me. I don't have to dig into my second stack. So, let's grab this blue. Oh, it's so bright and fun. I like it a lot. Okay, right there. And then on Thursday... I have three TV shows again. I have Grey's Anatomy, Superstore, and then the new season of RuPaul's Drag Race starts. Not the all-star season that just ended, which, by the way, I'm like, okay, here's the thing. I'm really happy with who won because I wanted that person to win, but I also felt like one other person kind of deserved to be in top two, but that's like, I don't know. I know it's over with and I'm happy, but I was like, oh, okay. But this is a new season. This is season 10. All new people. I'm very excited. And then, did I say Superstore? Superstore. So with three TV shows, I'm going to use one, the last TV little thing down here. And I think I'm only going to put two in. Um, I'm going to put in Superstore and Grey's Anatomy because I need to remember to record RuPaul's Drag Race because if I don't record it, I'm not going to be able to watch it. So I need to remember to, like, as soon as I get home from work, find it on the TV guide and record it. And so to do that, I'm going to use this, which I'm very excited about. I don't think it, well, I have talked about it in a video, but you haven't seen that video yet. But this is the My PR Sampler with Scribble Prints Co., which I'm very excited about. If you don't follow me on my planner Instagram, I definitely suggest you follow that. But this is the PR Sampler that I kind of helped design. Um, if you spend $30 up in SPC or more, SP more SPCs shop, um, you can use the code Kirsten10 for 10% off and you get this little sampler. I already used one of them in last week's spread, which I will show you. I have a ton of these and it is me reading, which is really cute. But the other one is also the other little scribbler girl that has my glasses is bundled up with a remote and I think that is perfect. There's also a class label, a work label, two hearts, three bows, two Erin Condren planners, and two candles, but I'm going to use the little me with a remote to remind myself to record because if I forget I'm gonna be really upset I'm gonna keep it down here and then I'll fit something else in up here I forget yeah, if I forget I'm gonna be really upset so that is it for Thursday this keeps popping up and it's really bothering me um Friday cream color I don't have like any cream colors really like in any of my um work labels so I think I'm gonna use this like peach which is like an off peach but again the motto of this plan with me is I will survive so just like, it's okay. So I'm gonna put this little peach in, little peach. Let me fix it, okay. Okay, that's, this header sideways, I can feel it. I mean, I'm a white space planner, so it should be okay, right? Anyway, so work, um, it is payday. So I have my payday, which are holographic. These are from uh, my newest addiction, sorry. They're the payday foiled scripts. And then I'm going to use a, piece of patterned washi with that let's do should I do the purple yeah I kind of want to use the purple not because it's like plain but because it is kind of plain it looks I don't know it just looks nice so I'm gonna put it right here let me do it sideways grab one of the my newest diction paydays which I like these a lot and they don't take a lot of space which I really like line her up that wasn't as even as I wanted it to be. Okay. 
put it right under here. Well, hold on. What else is going on Friday? Okay, that's not bad. Okay, good. Right under here. Take up all that space like that. Avery has dance again this week, which I'm again excited about because spring break is over. I'm going to be using the Kina Prince little girls dancing, which are so freaking cute. I love them so much. So I'm going to put one right here, kind of letting her hair go up into that glitter header. And then this is the day we plan to go to the rodeo. Um, so I am going to, okay, here's my dilemma. I really want to put everything down right now, but I'm also scared I'm going to have to undo it. And I only have one of these the Pumpkin Paper Co. girls with the cotton candy. I only have one of them. So, like, if I have to undo it and if she doesn't stick again, I am I might cry. <laughs> like, I might. So, I'm going to put it down. Really hoping that we go, which we should. We definitely are. We have plans with other people to go. So, like, even if they can't go, we're still going. So, it's fine. So, I'm going to use the... Um, do I use a pattern? Actually, let me be real. Like, real, real with you right now. I want to write it first on here before I stick it on here because last week I was having major issues writing a movie title down and I had to write it like three times on three different half boxes so just know that there will be a half box here that will say like fair or rodeo and really cute handwriting hopefully with one of this little pumpkin paper co like girls with the cotton candy just know that okay just just know that okay I'm not gonna put it for now because I'm anxious but I'll put it down later um okay so Friday's done Saturday, I need to put down the weekend banner before anything else. Otherwise, I will forget. So let's grab that. Oh, this is like so fun. I'm so glad I used this kit. Okay. Oh, please tell me this was on the right week. Okay, for some reason, I was like, did I write white out the wrong week? Anyway, and then the only other thing I have on Saturday is that I am working. So I need to use purple again. Let me go through my stack really quickly. I oh, I think, okay. I did use all of them from that little stack. Okay, so last work label of the week. And then honestly, nothing else is happening as far as I know Saturday. We might even end up going to the fair on Saturday, so that's why I think I'm just going to wait all together to put it in, just in case. It does end Saturday, so I don't know. We'll see. But we have plans with other people, so whatever. Um, Sunday, I already had my weekend banner, and then I need to put in one TV show, which is Bob's Burgers, which I'm very excited about. Um, I'm going to use the pink asterisk to mark that, and then that covers up all of that like excess white out that was along the bottom there. And that's slightly crooked, so that's not good. Let's just do a little bit of that. Okay, and then um, kind of like the basic stuff that I put in on Sundays, laundry and plan next week. And then Sunday is actually my like three-year anniversary-ish of being in school. So like three years of being in college, which is really exciting. I have a little over a year left. I graduate next April, which I'm really excited about. So I'll put that in too because I think that's kind of like an accomplishment. So I will do that and I also want to grab the little laundry. I love these little laundries. They're so cute. Put that in there. So I'll put it, should I do a quarter box? I think that would be fun. Let's do a quarter box. Um, do I do a plain quarter box though or do I do one of these like, no, I'm not going to do one of those. It's not that big of an event. Um, again, do I want to write in the quarter box on the paper? I think I'll be okay with doing it here just because like, I think I'll be okay. Now, do I do it here, though? Yeah, let's do it there. Let's do blue cream, because I don't have a lot of cream going on on this side. And I also kind of want a little piece of washi. Yeah, let's do this one. Sorry I've been really indecisive in this plan with me, guys. I try not to be, but I just it just happens. Also, I know I've been talking about Allie a lot. If she did recently start a YouTube channel, I hope she's, like, okay with me shouting her out please check out her channel i will link it down below she is my favorite person ever she's so funny and then i'm gonna use a little celebrate munchkin because like it's an accomplishment i don't know what i'm gonna write but like oh and it's it's cream too it looks so good okay so there's that um let's do the sidebar this actually looks really good though i'm like really happy okay so let's do the sidebar <laughs> um i think this week i'm gonna cut out again the YouTube video upload things because I'm only uploading I think one again this week so I'm gonna do the next week for sure which is always fun um, I need these and I need this okay so I'm gonna grab sweet like candy and put it right 
here. Hopefully you can see. Okay, you can. And then I'm going to do my habit trackers, which I feel like I can never find. I'm always losing things. Okay, so I'm going to do purple. Oh, oh god, that was white there. I was like really confused for a second. And then I need a piece of washi. I think the washi seam I'm going to stick with is this one because it's like real fun. And it's the only one that's like really bright and I like that a lot. Because this is a bright and fun week. Okay, but I really need you to like, okay, line up for me. So my habit trackers are for tidying up every single day. Just like basic kind of cleanup tasks. Making sure our house isn't completely trashed, which, which is very difficult with a three-year-old um, because there's always some sort of goldfish somewhere. And then this is for reading at least 30 minutes a day, which I've been doing a lot better with, especially last week when I had all the time in the world to read, which was nice. Um, did I read a lot, though? Not really. I think, well, no, I only did skip two days, but I don't feel like I got very far. It is such a big book. I think it's like over a thousand pages. I think it's like 1,100 pages. And it's good. It's really good. But I've been having nightmares about it. But I also don't care at this point. I'm like, you know what? If I'm going to have a nightmare, I'm going to have a nightmare. It's fine. So here's that. I'm going to see. Is there a next week header? There is. And it's blue. I kind of want to use a header. I have not used a header, you guys, in hot, hot minute. So let me use a next week header for the first time in my like entire life. Not the first time. I used to use the um, Planner Kate stackable sidebars if you guys remember that from forever ago let me know if you've been around from that long ago I don't think it's been that long honestly but um yeah and they always were nice and easy to work with so there is that I'm not gonna put a piece of washi down because I always never know if it's like the correct length so I'm gonna use this girl here with brown hair and like fair skin because like that's me right now and I'm gonna shove her up in here <laughs> and that fit perfectly that fit perfectly okay so there's that um wait bay. i have a lot of stuff here okay and then let's do some of these like little stars and whatnot around did i miss anything i always feel like i'm missing stuff i'll zoom you out a little bit too though there you go this looks a little bit more this looks so good you guys okay so this yeah this is just a lot this is a lot of deco I like it. It's really beautiful, but it's just, like I said, it's a ton. So I am going to put these little stars kind of in just random places just to bring some more blue and purple up there, but also to add just like a tiny bit of deco because I do love, love, love my deco. Okay, you want to come off? I don't think I'm grabbing it from the right end. Okay, I was going to say. I put those two close together. Um, well, I could do this. This would be pretty. See, like, some of this deco is not that large, so it's okay. But some of it is kind of big. So, I feel like I'm developing Allie's manner mannerisms, like, the way I talk. I'm sorry, Allie. I'm trying, just trying to be you. Okay. These stars are really pretty. I miss this kit. And I'm so excited I finally got to use it. I feel like that happens a lot for me. Like, I'll get a kit that's, like, really, really, really theme-specific. There's another one for Cinco de Mayo that's coming up that's very theme-specific for, like, either, like, Cinco de Mayo or just, like, for a lot of people it could be, like, a summer kit. But for me, it's very specific. So, like, the fact that I'm actually using it this year makes me really excited um, because I've had it for over a year. So, I think that happens to me more than probably it happens to anybody else. I watched Holly use the brunch kit that was April Mystery from SPC, and I'm still hoarding onto that kit because I need the perfect reason to use it, and she has a pretty great reason, but I was like, I need, a, I need a reason. So, I hoard kits for a really long time in hopes that I can eventually use them. Also, like, the June Mystery kit from SPC, the, like, uh, once upon a time like foresty fairy kind of kit. I'm using it in April and I'm very excited. Okay, so there's that. That's what this spread looks like. I'm so excited. Definitely follow my planner Instagram to see the final spread. I mean, I still <coughs> will show you like glimpses in you know these videos, but I just want you guys to be able to see it up close and you know kind of see everything that I put in throughout the week. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I think this turned out really great. I am using a blue pen like I said. So for everything on Crest Press Paper, which is just the work labels and the class label, I will be using this Paper Mate Inkjoy Gel 0 0.7 in this really, really bright blue. It matches this color perfectly. For anything on the SPC paper, and also 
I don't know about this paper. I think I used my uh, Pilot G2 on that one um, just because it's matte and it's a little difficult to write on. I'm going to be using the Sharpie Ultra Fine Point in a bright blue and then anything on the Erin Contran paper I'll be using this Pilot G2 0.7 in a bright blue. I need to get a lot more of these G2s because I have like 10 I think of colors but I need a better a better array. So that is it for this week's plan with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.